Hi hey guys, do you want to know what penetration testing uh, tools that can be fully utilized by the uh, penetration testers? Now, I have compiled my own, this is actually based on my own experience and I love to use this kind of tools. Um, some tools are for network and port scanners like Nmap, HPing, uh, latest version is HPing 3, and then we have Hydra, Ncrack, Hashcat. Uh, these three are for password cracking or password crackers. Uh, they are password cracker or recovery, uh, mostly dictionary. And we have the OpenVast, Tenable Nessus Pro uh, for the vulnerability scanning. Yeah, so they are vulnerability scanners. And we also have the Metasploit for the open source exploitation framework. And we have several web vulnerability scanners and even proxy. So they can be used uh, as vulnerability scanners as well as the proxies. Okay, and then we have Nikto, Burp Suite, very famous Burp Suite Pro, OWASP, Zap, Zap Attack proxy. With Nikto, Uniscan, and Acunetics. Yeah, so all of these are, you know, a combination of open source and commercial tools. Yeah. Of course, if you're doing, you know, legitimate penetration testing, you have to have these tools. Okay, so let me show you the tools. Yeah, so first I think um, uh, I will show you uh, in a, not in a, uh, not in an order. So this is Acunetics. This is actually good for uh you know scanning vulnerabilities on web application and then for network infrastructure you can use this nessus yeah i'm running nessus professional yeah and then we have the open source uh version of the uh, uh scanner called uh open vast so i'm running green bone security assistant yeah and then beside that we have let's say um let's see uh let's see um uh, nmap very famous port scanners um you know network scanner as well and then we have the ncrack for the password tracking mostly dictionary we also have hydra also for the password uh, cracking and we have the hashcat this is for password recovery and cracking as well and then we have nikto for web application vulnerability scanner i mean uh, web application vulnerability scanning and then don't forget the burp suite pro so i'm running pro version okay and then uh, i also have the oas zap yeah uh, that can be used as a web vulnerable scanner as well as uh, http proxy okay then uh let me open up another window and there's another tool called uh, metasploit yeah we just call the msf console yeah so this is a um an open source um, exploit framework uh, used to be uh, developed uh, for open source, but they also have uh, the uh, pro version uh, as a commercial uh, version. Okay, so you can do a lot of different things here. Yeah, just type show, maybe payload or maybe exploits. So perhaps uh, next time I'll be, uh, you know, um, discussing or uh, talking about the uh, the tool uh, in details. Yeah. So I will explain the use uh, of the tool uh, of the tools uh, one by one or in a very uh, detailed uh, manner. Yeah. Uh, what else we have? Um, yeah, this is uh, Uniscan. Yeah, this is also good for scanning for uh, 
or looking for a web vulnerability yeah so uniscan is a is a web vulnerability scanner uh, and then uh, so this is actually the yeah i think uh, i have all of the tools uh, available here now some of the tools are are already uh by default uh, uh what do you call this um available or exist in uh this kali so for example nmap the latest version yeah you can actually use the uh, sudo apt get update and upgrade to upgrade the uh, built-in tools yeah uh, some of the tools needs to be purchased like for example this one this is a professional version they'll cost you uh roughly around thousand something yeah and if we go to the uh, the website so we've got Nessus And we also have burp, burp suite by port suite. Okay, so let's just check. Hmm, I think my my Kali hangs. Yeah, but just leave it like that. Yeah. So, as I already mentioned, that the uh, some of the tools here are uh, commercial tools like a Nessus Pro, Burp Suite Pro, and also Metasploit. They have their uh, the uh, Pro version, and also the Uni uh, Acunetics uh, commercial edition uh, called Acunetics Web Vulnerability Scatter. Okay. So, um, nothing much. Uh, so perhaps. Uh, if I have more time, I will explain on how to use every single tool uh, in a proper manner and uh, will give you more detailed explanation. Okay, so that's all. Uh, nothing much. Uh, you just need to you know, look at the uh, compilation of uh, the uh, essential tools that, yeah, uh, that will be or uh, should be installed or uh, running on Kali. So of course you can use the um, Windows version or Linux version of the tools. So it's your preference, okay? So it's up to you whether you want to install it on Linux or you install if you want to install them in Linux or Windows or even like Mac, okay? All right, so um, I think that's all for this topic. Very short topic is just to give you an idea about what essential tools needs to be you know installed on your laptop or on your uh, you know Linux machine which could be your Kali okay so I'll see you next time thank you bye bye